And that was a little look at our first day on the MSC Meraviglia. It is the next morning now. In front of me is Marseille, France. It looks like this. What we did after I turned the camera off yesterday, I'm trying to remember, when did I stop filming? Well, we definitely went to dinner up in the buffet, and I have to say, the buffet is a huge, huge improvement over the last time that we cruised with MSC. It's still not, not really the same level as um, NCL or Royal Caribbean or AIDA, and I'm not saying that the quality is not good. What I'm still missing a little bit is um, variety. Um, they had um, some great pizza, great selection of cheese, great salads, and remember, I'm looking at this from like a vegetarian's point of view, and I know not everybody looks at it that way, but I'm doing, you know, my thing. So as far as vegetarian things go, there really wasn't a huge selection unless you want to have, you know, a salad and a cheese plate. And I like a salad and a cheese plate, but if there's not more variety than that, I'm going to get bored. We did not go to uh, the main dining room for dinner last night. Well, like I said, we went to the buffet, but sort of a difference is on... Um, on Royal and NCL you can go to the main dining room and they have the menu hanging up so you know Like if we were gonna go to eat there What would be the options and they don't have that on board on the MSC app? You can go and look at the menu, but then when you click on menu it just says dinner, which isn't very helpful we uh, went to see the show in the main theater, so they have two sort of uh, big shows at night they have the shows in the main theater which are uh, included in the price of your cruise, but you have to reserve in advance, and I'm going to say something about that in a second as well. And then they also have uh, official Cirque du Soleil shows, and those are in another theater in the back of the ship. Those shows cost extra, so you either have to book a drink and show package, which is 15 euros, or a dinner and show package, which is 35 euros. We will be doing that before, uh, before I leave the ship, but I don't know what night yet. Here's one interesting thing about going to see the, the, the shows in the main theater here. You have to have made a reservation in advance. And if you haven't met a, made a reservation, you can still show up. But then, the, then you need to go in this line to... Wait, let, let me start again. The Meraviglia is a very modern ship, so they have these interactive touch screens uh, in a lot of places, and I've seen these on a lot of other ships as well. You can use those, you know, to find information about where things are, to make restaurant reservations, and to make show reservations. And we showed up at the show last night, and we hadn't, ha we didn't have a reservation, so we had to wait in an extra line. And then before they would let us go into the theater, a crew member took our card went to one of these interactive screens and reserved us into the show and then we had to go back and get in the other line to get into the theater and it just seemed just seemed weird you know i'm not saying that 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 alone would be a reason to never cruise with this ship or with msc but it's just weird i've never had to do something like that before you know i've had I have been on ships where you uh, where you can and should make a reservation to get into a performance. I have also been turned away uh, because I didn't make a reservation. But I also know that, you know, if I remember it correctly, on most other ships where you can make a reservation, uh, if you uh, after a certain time, like at ten minutes before the show begins, then they just start letting everybody in reservation or not and I don't know why they don't do that here the show itself by the way the performers were the performers were very talented but the show itself was not really good it was a flamenco and traditional spanish dance show and you know I've seen like purely dance shows on other ships and in big theaters as well on land and I wouldn't put this at one of the higher levels of like, I really want to see that again. In fact, we did something that we almost never, ever, ever do. We didn't stay till the end. So I'm sorry to all the performers uh, who were doing their best with the show that they were given, but uh, after a half hour of, yeah, like sad, emoting Spanish music with people 
just dancing. I guess I had had enough. Sorry. As I said, we are in Marseille now, and uh, Marcus is up at the gym. I'm going to go up to the gym too, just do a little workout, burn off some of the calories. And then we are going to try to do a hop on, hop off tour of this beautiful third largest city in France. But that's going to be in my next video. So if you want to see that, be sure to subscribe. You can follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And uh, I look forward to seeing you then here on the very unofficial travel guides very soon. Au revoir.